Hello everyone, and today I'll show you how to fix the overhead and issue on your Nothing Phone 2A. So in order to do that, first of all, let's close our backgrounds applications. So in order to do that, simply swipe, swipe up from the very bottom of your screen. You've got your list of open applications. So if you need to close some specific ones, simply drag it up and they will close or uh, scroll to the very uh, end of your application list and press clear all. Now all of your applications are clear. The other great way to fix the problem is to remove the battery draining application. So let's go to settings, go to your battery tab here, uh, find your battery usage. And here you've got the whole list of the most battery draining applications. So if you find any of them unnecessary or particularly heavy, simply delay them. Also, please avoid using the phone while charging because when you are charging your phone, uh, do not play the games or watch videos. This could be one of the reasons for, the, for overheading. It's better to leave the phone to charge without using it. Don't forget to check for free storage. So go to your settings. Once again, uh, find your storage section here. And if there are a free little space left, delete unnecessary files or games, clean your cache. This can reduce the load on the device and help solve the overheating issue. Also, do not forget to turn off your glyph interface because sometimes the glyph lights, as we see, it's already turned off. However, if it looks like this, it means it's on, so simply tap on the switch you see glyph lights are the flash indicators and there might be the reason for overheading so the last but not least uh, is to update your software because so sometimes this could fix the bugs which are causing overheading so in order to do that go to your uh, system tab here it is now find your system update click and if there are any updates available like uh, I do have one available, simply press the load and install, press connect to Wi-Fi if you are not connected, I'm not connected apparently, but simply install your application, uh, install your update, give it a few seconds to update and you're good to go. I hope this video was helpful, thank you so much for watching and have a great day.